all righty how's everybody doing so survived the ice storm that was uh <clears throat> that was interesting um then we ended up getting flooding and everything turned from ice to a complete mud pit and today it's a fairly decent day and uh weather's starting to warm up a little bit it should be up and up and down we're still still waiting on springtime but uh one of the projects I want to get off the list is trying to remain as self-sufficient as possible even though moving the operation from you know uh, off-grid cabin into basically an off-grid schoolie um, is just a big weight on my shoulders and something's just just constantly been bugging me is the the enormous uh, air conditioner setting up on the roof that requires a pretty large generator to run uh, and since there is no power grid out here um, and I don't really plan on going only places that have electricity um, so I think the better option would be to get rid of the air conditioner and I'm going to replace it with just a 12 volt uh, fan that can be used as an exhaust fan or bring air in or out depending on so I've been making window screens for the uh, windows so they can all be opened up and still get nice airflow without having bugs come in. And uh, that's helped out a lot. I think being able to vent some of the hot air um, <clears throat> out, of the, out of the roof uh, will be beneficial as well. So, uh, so the plan for today is uh, I've got a friend coming out and uh, everybody's got that one guy you can call on when you've got a really stupid project. And yeah, I've got a, got a buddy like that. And, He's willing to hop up on top of the school bus, school bus with me and try to lower this air conditioner down. Um, hopefully the, the plan is to not damage the air conditioner and hopefully we don't damage the bus. So, but yeah, we get that off then we can get the fan in place and uh, get that wired up and, and uh, we'll see how that goes. But that, that's the only thing that really ties the bus to the, to the necessity for any kind of a large generator or power grid is this massive air conditioner on the roof. And it is nice to, I've, I've, we've used it, I've turned on the air conditioner, uh, the generator and ran the air conditioner in it, and it works well. You can hang meat inside this little bus, but I don't need to hang meat, I just need to keep it comfortable in here. So, if, and honestly, if I'm somewhere and it gets that hot to where the window's being open and the fan running is not doing the trick, man, just turn the key, start up the house and drive it somewhere else. And, uh, you know, head to where the weather's a little more little more friendly I, I would imagine so so anyway with that being said we're going to try to get this air conditioner off here and uh yeah well hopefully everything goes goes fine i'll set up a couple cameras and uh, don't probably won't be doing a whole lot of narrating or talking but i'll try to get some cameras set up and uh cover it from a couple angles while while we work on removing this thing and uh yeah let's hope everybody stays safe and everything goes goes smoothly so anyway hang in there
<laughs> no doubt. No, I got to. This is like the only chance I'm going to get to stick my head through the top of the bus. <laughs> I can't see. Okay, I got you. You got it recording? Yep, I think so. Yep. I can't tell. The sun's in the way. Yes, the little red light is on. Is that recording? It is. All right. <laughs> it's still recording. That's all right. Alright, so that's it for this episode of This Old School Bus. Uh, we're going to cut it right there. I still need to wire in the fan and put, take some flex seal. And I want to seal up the, the roof seams, uh, those I couldn't get to before when I sealed the roof because the air conditioner was in the way. So, so anyway, um, glad that's out of the way. Air conditioner's off. Uh, still have to, like I say, wire it in and trim the uh, bezel to fit on the inside and get that bolted in place to kind of pretty it up a little bit and uh, we'll do that on another video so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed thanks for watching god bless everybody hit the like button subscribe it really helps out and uh, we'll see you on the next one